All right, guys, we're at it again. Here we go. We're talking about PS3. Okay, I'm going to talk to you right now about something that you should be doing on a daily basis, every single day. It doesn't matter whether you're part time, spare time, or full time. Okay, this is this right here is extremely important for your success. You got to be consistent. It's it's a little thing to do, but it's also a little thing not to do. Okay, now I'm going to talk about it's called PS3. It's kind of like a video game. PS3. The P stands for peaking interest, the S stands for show, show some information, and the three stands for a three-way call. Every single day, what you want to be doing is peaking some people's interest. Now, if you're doing this business on a part-time basis, you should be doing this at least two to three times a day. What I'm about to explain to you. If you are doing the business on a full-time basis, you're talking anywhere from at least five to ten times every single day. Part-time, two to three times a day, full-time, five to ten times, okay? Let's talk about it. The P stands for peak interest. Hey, Bob, are you open to making more money? That's peaking interest. Hey, Bob, do you drink coffee? That's peaking interest. You want to peak their interest. It just simply means, you know, do you drink coffee or tea at least occasionally? Hey, or if you want to use the product, you, you know, do it that way. Do you drink coffee or tea at least occasionally? Or if you're, you know, using the opportunity, are you open to making more money? The P stands for peaking their interest. It's very simple. Warm or cold market, it doesn't matter. You're just peaking interest. Remember when I taught you in a previous segment? Hey, listen, excuse me, maybe you can help me out. I'm looking to help a large company expand here in the area that doesn't advertise. By chance, you know anybody that's open to making more money, even if it's you. Again, the P stands for peaking interest, okay? You got it? Now, after we've peaked someone's interest, the S stands for show them some information. Show them some information. Remember, the name of this game is to get people in front of the information. That's it. That's it. To get people in front of the information. People that have been peaked, to get them in front of the information is the name of the game. Now, there's different, uh, different, you know, different uh, ways that you can show the information. For example, you can simply get someone to come to a coffee and jazz mixer, better known as a CJM. A coffee and jazz mixer, as you know, is nothing more than a home meeting where people come on over, they taste the coffee product, okay? And literally, uh, either an executive like myself is there to do a presentation, or we simply pop in a DVD and let the DVD explain it all for you. So again, the first way is getting a person over to a coffee and jazz mixer, okay? Uh, the second way, is that you can actually get a person onto a, uh, 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 a, a uh, we have a conference call that we do. It's a pre-recorded, 24 hours on demand conference call. Myself is the speaker on there, and it's done for 30 minutes. Where we explain everything about the opportunity. Here is the phone number, 916-233-3990, and the PIN number is 86742, and the pound sign. 24 hours a day. See, it's pretty exciting to know that you don't have to wait for a person to go to a meeting. We'll bring the meeting to them. All right? Uh, the third way you can get a person in front of the information, you can send them to the website, ogshow.com. ogshow.com. Have them click on presentation. Okay? And then the fourth way, uh, obviously, they can, you can actually go to their house or you know, send them a DVD and have them watch the Coffee That Pays DVD. And then the fifth way, maybe you can do a one-on-one -on -one presentation where you can meet a person over coffee on a one-on-one -on -one and you can simply use your flip chart to explain the business to them, okay? All right, so what you see here, guys, is the S stands for we must now show our prospect some information. You can pick and choose what and how you want to show them based upon geographic location. You know, you can pick and choose how you want to show them the information. Obviously, what I've done here is I've put, uh, uh, I've put it on the board in what I feel is uh, numerical or chronological or numerical, however you say it, order of what I think should come first, coffee and jazz mixer, conference call, maybe the website, the DVD, or one-on-one, okay? All right, so show them some information. Now, let's talk about what the three represents in PS3. Three is very important, but before you get to the three, after your prospect has seen the information, now you want to edify. Remember we talked about in a prior segment, 
edification, very important right now. You want to edify your expert to your prospect and you want to do a three-way phone call. For those of you, I'm hoping that everybody understands what I mean when I say a three-way phone call. It's where you use your cell phone or your home phone and you basically connect two parties together on the same line. It's a three-way phone call. And what you want to do is you want to edify your, uh, uh, you want to edify your expert or you want to edify your expert to your prospect. So hey, let's say if I, my prospect's name was Bob and let's say my expert name was, 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 was uh, Sarah. Hey Bob, listen, that was some great information that you saw. Hey listen, I happen to be very, very fortunate. I'm working with one of the top executives in all of North America, a lady who's not only making money herself, but showing a lot of people like me how to make it as well. She loves to help people. She's a lot of fun, but she has all of the details. I was just mentioning your name to her, and she wanted to privately meet you over the phone if you had a couple of moments, Bob. Okay, well, great. Let me introduce you to you. Hey, Bob, this is Mrs. Johnson. Mrs. Sarah Johnson, this is Bob. And now you merge the calls together, and you don't say anything else after, after you've introduced the two of them together. So the three stands for a three-way call. The purpose of a three-way call is so that the expert can actually now talk with your prospect, hear out what their concerns is, overcome their objection, and sign up the prospect for you. The purpose for the three-way call is so the expert can actually overcome the objection of your prospect and basically get them involved in your business. The other purpose for a three-way call is so that the expert can revalidate who you are. You see, typically your prospect knows you on a personal level. And now when your expert says, hey, I'm working with XYZ distributor and this person is with me and you know what it does is it makes the prospect feel like, whoa, you're connected with that person? You're tied into him or her? Wow, you, you must be going places. And so again, the purpose of the three-way call, overcome the objections of the prospect, okay, get them started, and also to revalidate you so that the prospect will now listen to you more because now you're following us. Does that make sense? Hopefully you got it. Every single day, PS3, PS3. Really simple, something you can do while you're in the grocery store. Peek a person's interest, move them some information, set up a three-way call. It's very simple. Two to three times a day for the part-timers, five to 10 times a day for the full-timers, okay? Guys, PS3 is a very valuable tool. Use it.